Hello everyone, welcome back to my Unreal Engine tutorial series on how to create an open world game. So actually this is my 101th episode and yesterday I realized when I am going to upload the video and put the name then only I realized that so this is the 100th episode so I should have made some announcement but I was already late because I have already completed recording the video so yeah so therefore I am saying that today and I am quite happy with that alright so let's get back to work okay so this is what I am going to do you to do today so this as you all already know these blue and red are two teams and whenever they see each other they start fighting and we have that part already implemented and the new part is uh, that uh, before they see enemies they have a normal routine normal routine i call it duty so the normal duty will be just roaming around later on we can implement that to other functions as well like patrolling so yeah whenever they freely roam around if they see an enemy they will start attacking attacking and after the fighting is done they will return to normal duties they will put back their weapons in the back and return to free roaming so that's what i'm going to do you show you today so let's see the demonstration first okay now they are free roaming and two of the guys already seen the enemy and this that blue enemy also saw him and this one also right now they have started fighting and already killed they are fast this time yeah after the enemies where all the enemies are dead they should put back their weapons right okay two of the guys did and all of them are now back to normal duties all right so that's all that's what i'm going to do to show you today and as always this episode is sponsored by these generous patreons thank you very much for your support that means a lot to me also if you want to support my work you can get the membership of my patreon club and depending on the membership you get you will have the access to source code and other code snippets and also you can ask questions there right so let's get back to work all right so the first thing i have to do is i need to define some method to invoke the normal duty or normal behavior of these characters enemy characters so i'll open my ai human blueprint and here i think i have already defined some method no i we only have this go to location method so right i'll collapse this go to and I'll define a new method or a function under BPI called resume duty so this would be as the uh, this would be the function I would call in order to resume the normal behavior of these characters I'll implement that here event resume duty right so now whenever I resume duty first I should sheath if I have equipped any weapons so sheath no 
toggle weapon and bpi character and set equip to false and uh, then i should that uh, that's let's say that's the first part uh, now then let's make this guy free roam like this go to location and pick a random location around the current location of the character so like this get random point random reachable point in radius and as for the origin I'll give get after location as for the radius I'll give thousand and I'll add a delay here like 10 seconds actually we can randomize this one as well float in range 5 to 10 and after that first I should check if I am on alert mode that means I have seen some enemy if this is true then I should stop this duty normal duty and that means I am on searching for enemy or I am in a fight if this is false then I can call this same function like this right so this would be my normal behavior and I'll resume duty at the beginning of the play now let's see how they behave well they are running okay and I think I should make them not running when they resume normal duty let's make toggle run to force like this now they should not be running they should casually work why aren't they working okay the problem should be my running speed and working speed here in the ch human character and the moment running speed and working speed is set to 600 and 300 but for some reason this extended class uh, the ch enemy character this has been reset to zero so when i set this to default values it should work okay first yeah i should come here and here this is something i just did to test now let's test again okay now they are working freely and yeah right so now we should make some way to 
identify if they start a fight then after the fighting is done they should return or this we should call this resume duty function so first I'll collapse this I'll call it duty and so where is the fight in happening yeah it happens here and where do we make this false this is the only place that we toggle attack mode right so why don't we use this part but first we need a way to identify that there are no valid enemies so okay let's do something like this let's save the time value at this moment get time what is the method I should use okay let's take this and I'll promote this to a variable as last alert time I put mm, this as alert because this can be last seen time or last heard time. So to be fair for both cases I put as last alert time. Right. Now under this method when I toggle sensors back should I do it like that? no let's create a new method here let's call it a custom event check fight status so what this method does is well I need a way to make this part call only once so let's not do this here let's put it here do once and so after this part I'll do I'll make a delay of 10 seconds and check if last alert time get time seconds is that the way I took yeah yeah so let's compare the current time and the time we last saw an enemy mm -hmm. well I should put this part not here I should put it before this part so that means here because regardless of this uh, this whatever happens here whenever I saw an enemy I should update this variable so it should be here okay now yeah and no this is not the way I should do that this one minus this one 
and if this time is larger than let's say 20 seconds for now let's do a branch if this is true then I should resume duty and if this is false let's call this part again and here I should reset this because once again I if I start a attack I should be able to call this check fight status part part I'll collapse this section and call it check fight status I'll put a comment also so that I can see it clearly when I zoom it out okay now I I think that's all I have to do. Right. Okay, so let's check. So here we have a blue enemy and here we have a red one. So let's play. So this is what should happen. Uh, whenever these red guys see the blue guys, they should equip their weapons and start fighting and after the fighting is done after uh, more than 20 seconds they should sheath back the sword and resume their normal duties that means just roaming around let's check okay now they saw him and they are going to fight and in one shot they killed him so because the all three of them attacked him that's why they it was killed soon right so now let's wait for these guys to put back their weapons and start roaming around I think I should have put less than 20 seconds because if the first 20 second is long if this didn't work in the first 20 seconds then we should wait another 20 seconds right finally they are back on the normal duty swords are in the back alright so that's uh, what is this error never mind let's fix that later so that's all i wanted to do for today and in the next time let's fix this error definitely and also let's work on other issues and improvements for these enemies all right see you in the next episode